Have you seen this yet? This video that's gone viral around the world. There it is again. Look at that deer crash right through the window of a hair salon on Long Island. It jumped over a woman who was sitting there on the couch. Today, we talked with her about what happened there. News Force, Greg Sergal, live in Lake Rock, Conkoma. Greg, of course, we want to know how she's doing. Well, Natalie, after a quick trip to the hospital on Saturday, that 75-year-old was smiling today, actually laughing about her close encounter with that deer. But the incident that saw the deer smash through a window in the salon behind me highlights an ongoing problem of deer showing up in places now that once they were never seen. Uma Sadani was back home today, still bruised and sore after this. A deer slamming through a salon window as the 75-year-old sat on the couch. I thought I was uh, having a dream or something. More like a nightmare. And that crazy video, Sadani says, prompted calls to her from around the world. From India, everybody's calling, oh, we saw you on Facebook, are you okay? I said, I'm fine, I'm fine. The cell phone video shows the damage inside the Lake Ronkonkoma salon after the deer ran out the door. The salon was open today, its front windows still boarded up, and slivers of shattered glass still on the ground. Owner Janice Heredia says she still can't believe what happened. All I hear is this loud um, crash, and I'm thinking in my mind, a car just slammed into my salon, and when I look, it's a deer. This bizarre incident highlights a problem across Long Island. Too many deer. The areas in yellow on this map, Long Island, New York City, and Westchester, are all hotspots for deer, according to state environmental officials. Vehicles collide with deer 70,000 times a year in New York, including a crash in Riverhead Sunday night. But despite those problems, many communities just can't agree on the most humane way to reduce the deer herd. Deer rescues like this have become commonplace on Long Island in recent months. Frank Floridia has pulled the animals out of fences and sports netting. The solution is not to kill them. The solution is to, you know, work with everybody and get this done humanely. Now, Staten Island is actually one of the few urban or suburban communities in New York with a deer management plan. Male deer are being sterilized there. And this past June, New York City, uh, New York City said the number of deer in the herd on Staten Island is actually down 15%. We're live in Lake Ronkonkoma. Greg Sergal, News 4 New York. That video is just All right, Greg. Great. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey, YouTube. Thanks for watching this video from NBC4 New York. You can stay up to date by hitting the subscribe button below me. Also on the left, you can see some of our latest updates, investigations, and features. We'll see you next time.